Just pick up the camera, they said. Just film anything, they said. They'll love it. Poachman here. Uh, I just returned from a motivational session with uh, uh, one of my young, uh, young friends at the donut shop. And uh, he's bugging me. Uh, I should do more content. So thanks, buddy. Come home. The battery was magically full. And uh, yeah, let's turn it on. Let's walk around film stuff. So uh, this is not the, the CUDA video yet, it's, but it's coming. So I've been, uh, I've been in moving mode, as you know. Uh, or may not know, whatever. But anyway, so I've been... My goal now is to get all my cars running, the ones I'm going to keep, whatever. Get them all running. And um, get them all running. Maybe drive them, take them to the donut shop. So anyway, I've been working on several of them, the CUDA being one of them, and the A100. Uh, this little gem here has been sitting for a little while. It used to be my daily, and uh, sat for a few years, and I've been tinkering with this thing. So I got this one running. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw that I did the little dash piece here. And... Uh, She's cold-blooded. So I got it running. Um, and I decided to change. The seats were pretty thrashed in it. Where are the seats? Can you see it? Can you see it? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty rugged. Uh, so I had this PT Cruiser over there I'm going to chop up. Right? I got one more PT Cruiser to chop up. And um, I had a couple seats in it. And magically, the PT Cruiser seats fit in this thing perfectly. I used the original mounts and everything. Um, so that's what I'm going to do with that. PT Cruiser seats. It's cheaper than uh, getting the old ones reupholstered, I guess. And they look cooler. I don't know whether I like the armrest or not. I might take the armrest. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah. What the hey. So this one runs. And then I've been tinkering with uh, a little 63. A little 63 dart here. That was my daily back in the day and it's been sitting for a number of years. Um, and I got it running. So let's see if we fire this bad boy up. I just put a new master cylinder on. I got the brakes all, brakes all working. And let's see what happens here because I've got some older gas and the needle and seat sticks on this thing. So I threw some, uh, So it runs. I got some older gas in it. And I'm running off of this tank here because I'm not sure what the tank in the car is going to look like until I can get it up and get the tank off and get a look inside. But the needle and seat sticks on it. So after it sits overnight, the varnish in the gas makes the needle stick. So I had to wank on it with a screwdriver. I don't know if you saw the bowl start to flood and fill. It's got a see through, holiday see through. Uh, glass bowl, which is pretty cool But anyway, I threw some Marvel about a Pint of Marvel mystery oil in the oil to try to see if I could get it loosened up but Apparently it didn't work last night Maybe tomorrow I'll try it again. Maybe the magic mystery oil will work. Anyway, so I got this one running. Pea sweet uh, I've been tinkering with this one. Haven't got it running yet, but I did clean out the inside of it um, Some couple of mice were living in it 
So I pulled the seat out and vacuumed it out. Um, I want to get this one. Uh, this one runs. It's been a while. Uh, get it running again. Um, yeah, you. Pretty cool old flathead. P sweet. Um, and then I started tinkering with the uh, this one over here. Another uh, another sixty three. Have three of these sixty three GTS. Uh, I haven't got this one running, but I did clean blow out the engine compartment because um, it was full of crap. And I did get some wheels and tires put on it. Um, I did rob all the brakes off this car, but the trunk is filled with brake stuff. So once I get some of this other stuff situated, I'll roll it, put it on the lift and start getting it running, driving. I might sell that one. I'll sell the 66, get it running and driving. Sell it. Uh, the Valiant is not mine. And then you guys remember the Volkswagen, electric Volkswagen. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. I, I had it for sale. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. It's pretty cool. Pretty fun car to play with. But, yeah. So, anyway, it's just a little update of what's going on around here. I've been selling off a bunch of stuff in the shop. A bunch of uh, bins and cabinets and stuff I got rid of. Kind of been doing some organization in here. Been utilizing um, milk crates. My buddy at the, buddy's at the donut shop. Senor Tone been giving me some milk crates, so I've been tagging them and storing all my crap in them. And uh, yeah, the next video, very I think the next video is gonna be about this bad boy right here. Yes, sir. And um, I have to tell you about my saga about the fuel uh, gas cap. So I've been getting some of my stuff from Jags, Jags, and. Uh, ordered a gas cap and um, and they sent me the gas cap box but there was a thermostat in the gas cap and it was like a thermostat for an import so I had a little dealings with uh, customer service and they finally got back to me and sent me a gas cap and here's what I got not even close so yeah I still need a gas cap Oh, well, this one might clean up pretty good. I might end up using this one. The rubber seal is... I think it'll still work. But it's just kind of grody looking. and That one, not only is it too small, it looks pretty cheeseball. So, anyway. But, um, yeah. Getting ready to uh, get this one running next. So... Uh, yeah, so stay tuned for that, and uh, we'll see you later. And uh, thanks again, Isaiah, for the motivation. Uh, I don't know how long it'll last. Probably not very long, but uh, 